Hi, Sailor Jupiter Lita here. And today I'm going to talk about something that I think that would be good. And it's obviously Sailor Moon related. About the Sailor Moon movie games. And I'm not talking about the newest ones. But I'm also talking about the newest ones and the oldest ones too. Since they both have never ever been released in the United States. Or anywhere else except for maybe, I don't know, Japan, France, or Italy, for example. Now, in 1900, now, Sailor Moon did have games that came out for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System by Nintendo, but by made by Bandai, and to the Sega Genesis by Sega, made by Bandai. But they never got any international releasing. None of the games. Not even the arcade one. You know, not even the ones that eventually would come out to the Sony PlayStation, you know, by Sony, by Bandai, none of them. And then the newest ones that came out, most likely, back around 2009 AD or so, they never only got released only in Italy. Well, and one Sail Moon game got released also in France, and that's about it. So why was this so selective? Why did the Sail of Moon games not get any international release? That's, I really don't know. Everybody could have their beholdings over it, but not really know. Some people might say they weren't really that good as games. Some might say that Nintendo and Bandai and Toei felt that the Sail of Moon games might not would made would not bring enough Weir Guild in. If they sold them outside of Japan, that Sega, Bandai, and Toei may have felt the same way. I don't know. All I know is, is that they never gotten any international releases. And that was kind of sad. You know. Because for some, for sense, for some reason, you would think that all the Sailor Moon movie games would have gotten released. You would have think that since everything else worked out, you think they would have gotten released, but they never did. You know, and a lot of that might lead a lot of people into believing that there never were any, but there were. There were two, there were actually about two that came out for the Super Nintendo, one for the Sega Genesis, some that came out for the Sony PlayStation. Now, regardless of that, why did they not get released? I don't know. <clears throat> I have no win why Toei and Bandai and Nintendo and Sega chose not to release them outside of Japan. Why was o why only one Sailor Moon game got released in Italy and that was it and that was years later. And why Sail one Sailor Moon game released in France and that was I really don't know why that was. You know. Now, most likely, I don't know. Maybe they didn't bring enough money in. Maybe they didn't bring enough Weir Guild in. Maybe they didn't do very well. I don't know. But for whatever reason, um, Nintendo and Bandai and Toei and Sega, Bandai and Toei, they chose not to release the Sailor Moon games outside of Japan. Yeah. They only made it choose to release one in France and one in Italy, but that was years later. And I don't know why. The same thing really actually the sale of V game did get released on a on the Nintendo on the Sega Dreamcast. But that was a different story for a different self. Apparently also the Sailor Moon arcade game, according to the story, got released on the Sega Dreamcast as well. But I really don't know because I never really played them. I played the Sailor Moon games back in the, not back in the day, but I did play the Sailor Moon on the Sega Genesis on Games for Win. I also played, also downloaded, also played the Sailor Moon uh, on a, on a Super Nintendo on, you know, from a different website, downloading the drivers and installing them and all that stuff. Um, but obviously, I never ever, but obviously when I tried to play the arcade one, it just would not take. But the point is, 
Unfortunately, they never got released outside of Japan. Why was that? I don't know. And I'm sure a lot of Sailor Moon followers have their beholdings, their why they think this was done, but they really don't know. You know, the only people that probably know why it was done would be Nintendo and Sega and Bandai and Toei, obviously, would be the only people that would know why this was done. That's it. I'm Sailor Jupiter Lita. Hope you enjoyed this movie show. Bye.